What's happening guys? Well, today I'm going to be taking apart pistons in the Keith walking floor. Now, yeah, as you can see it's pretty much, I blew out the uh, casing, it's destroyed because um, all the pipes are rotted under here and of course those are welded and you can't just replace those. So we're going to put a set of pistons in this thing. And I've never done a set, and it should be interesting. But I got a good working knowledge of this trailer, so we'll just take care of it bit by bit and uh, keep you guys up to date on how it's going to go. Should be interesting. All right, so I have the the U tubes out from um, underneath it with all the uh, check valves, and I'm starting to pull the top bolts out. A little tricky to get it out, but not a big deal. Still. I'm not using anything complicated. Uh, every much, everything is pretty much coming out. This thing is a 99, means 2017, so this thing's 18 years old here. Yeah. And the bolts are coming out pretty good. I've only had to use the torches once on a couple of the lower bolts because they were pretty rotted. And um, I'm getting there. Pretty close to taking these things out of here, dropping them down. Well, the suck part about working outside, it's starting to Rain, sleet, snow, whatever the fuck it's starting to do, but whatever. Billy, come on down here and bring Brian with you, okay? Jesus Christ. Sorry about the radio. Alright, so I got the couple of clamps off. One and two. Took some heat. Heat wrench. One size fits all. And a three-quarter gun with a, uh, with a small, I had the, uh, the smaller tip put on there. So it could reach up in the middle and, and heat shit up without catching stuff on fire. So they're out. All you gotta do is take out the uh, the pin bolts here. So it's holding it up. And I'm gonna drop this, these, drop well, one of them. I'm gonna drop that sucker on the ground. And we'll see, uh, I'll show you guys when they, all three of these come out of here. All right, should be done in a little while. So I got one out. Now I'm just heating the other side here. I got one out and down. I'm just heating up the uh, threads a little bit, not a lot. Just enough to get the three-quarter gun to get these things to turn because they're, they're just stuck in there and this thing's so old. All the old paint's catching fire. I'm trying to just keep it from burning <laughs> at this point. But take one down, I got more room. And now I'll have the other, the other two out of here and hopefully soon. So I'm just gonna keep warming this thing up and hit it with the gun. All right, all three of them are out. Now I blew out one of the cylinders here. These are the old style ones. The new ones screw in to the cylinders, the pipes, I mean. Um, so these are the old style. This trail, like I said, this trail is a '99. Right, all three cylinders out. We'll be doing another video, putting them, doing the reinstall. But first, I got to clean. I'll show you that here. All right, so. That's what it looks like with no cylinders in it. Just a couple of pipes over here and a couple of spots where the uh, where the floor attaches to. You know, it's where the cylinders are held up. Right here. Those are kind of a pain in the ass to get to. But it is what it is. It's a good working system, so you always gotta cover your tubes, make sure no shit gets in them. Because that would suck. Oop, oh, forgot a bolt. Yes, I'm wearing gloves. Uh-huh. Go ahead. Say what you want. <laughs> That's it, man. Reinstall next.